power is changing. It used to be that state authorities controlled citizens by controlling information. Now digital data can be shared easily at no cost. Leaks are as simple as pushing a button. Previously powerless individuals gain power through the interconnectivity of the internet, and they're challenging the establishment. But the establishment is fighting back. There are moves to control the internet and to control our communication with each other. This is the information war. Who controls information, who can see it, and who can share it. From here in London, I travel around the world to the battlegrounds in the information war. I travel to hackerspaces from Berlin to Boston to find out why hackers are becoming so politically active. I go to America to visit Google and Facebook and find out what they know about us. I visit Iceland to find out why that country has become such a center for digital freedom. And I enter the murky world of WikiLeaks, from its inception to its disintegration, looking at the collateral murder video and my own experience with the US diplomatic cables. The stakes are high in the information war. If the internet is controlled, it could usher in a new age of censorship, surveillance and oppression. Alternatively, we could be on the cusp of a new form of global democracy with people in power.